Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang. I'm a math expert from the St. Petersburg, Florida, and we're here to talk about how to calculate cubic meters. Now, all you really need to calculate cubic meters is a pen, paper, and a calculator if you need it. So, let's get started. Now, a cubic meter is a three-dimensional measurement where every dimension is a meter. Now, if you come across units that are not meters, the first thing that you have to do is to convert them to meters. So, first, suppose you want to find out the volume of a box. where length is equal to 3 meters, width is equal to 2 meters, and the height of the box was 4 meters. Now I want to note that if one of the dimensions is not meters, if it's centimeters or feet, you have to convert them to meters for you to calculate cubic meters. Now, just as a reminder, the volume of a box is length, width, height. So it's length times width times the height. So all you really need to do is plug all the numbers in, but make sure you include the dimensions. So you have 3 meters times 2 meters times 4 meters. Now, 3 times 2 is 6, and 6 times 4 is 24. But the other thing you want to keep in mind is that you need to multiply the dimensions as well. Meters times meters is meters squared, and meters squared times meters is meters cubed. So that means the volume of this box is 24 cubic meters. Now there are a lot of other geometry formulas that you can find the volume, but this is just one example. The important key is to convert all your units into meters so you can find cubic meters. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's how to calculate cubic meters.